Hello and welcome to Sexy Astrology for January 2015, the month of freedom and hard work. So get up off your lazy ass. Happy New Year from Sexy Astrology. Yeah, so it's the month of laziness. In case you were wondering, oh my God, can I tell you how fucking hard Capricorns like to work? They like to work so hard. And they like to do it every day. So that's this month is um, brutal for many of us because it's so cold in upstate New York. And uh, the other half is there's two kinds of cars. The really fancy ones that are super fly and unpredictable. And then the ones that are kind of boring and just get you from A to B and they work really well. So guess which kind of car I am? <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> yes, the other alternative to the automobile is that it could also be tacky and good quality at the same time. Ah! The well-oiled machine is what we're after. Hello everybody and welcome to Sexy Astrology for the month of January 2015 and happy birthday Capricorn. Okay, your colors are red, black, and white and steel gray. It's the month of freedom and hard work. On the flip side, laziness and bondage. Capricorns like to work so, so hard. They do. Oh my God, the amount of stuff they do. My brother is a Capricorn and he once worked for 10 years straight every single day. Was it a good idea? No, but they're capable of working extremely hard. They are a good example for all of us. It's also the month of two kinds of cars, um, the tacky and the good quality, the super fly vehicle that gets you everywhere, that goes around and gets you everywhere, but is really tacky, kind of, like just for show, and the good quality car that is rather boring. <laughs> so anyway, lots of things going on this month. I'm going to expand a little on the business of Pluto and Capricorn since we're around 12 degrees Pluto um, in, uh, in Capricorn in the sign, 12 degrees Capricorn in the sign, uh, in, in the, the planet of Pluto in the sign Capricorn. Um, yeah, so... Yes, so dear Capricorn, for January 2015, happy birthday to you. Pluto, Mercury, Venus, and the Sun all lined up in your sign. You're in your element. You're enjoying the right amount of work and the right amount of emotional give and take that it requires to keep you afloat. Um, I might add the tiny touches you add on. You, wait a minute. In your element, Capricorn, might I add the tiny touches you add on at work, the interactions at work really matter right now, especially if you are in a position of authority. You have a lot of power. Um, every day matters personal consideration, gut feelings, and design. You are a little bit like a Virgo. Okay, now... P.S. You might be getting busted as well um, and being found out, I have to say, if you are in any kind of a bondage situation at work, now it will end, either in romance or dynamics with coworkers. You must come clean. You will be found out. Just let it go. It's not worth it. Okay? Have a great one. Yes, Capricorn, in the name of healing, there's going to be a healing, and it's public. Go. Go to the mountain. Tell it on the mountain. Okay, and one more thing, everybody. I have to tell you 
that Santa Claus was a Capricorn. Have a nice day, and we'll see you tomorrow.